Okay, this Alice video follows on from the last one. If you haven't seen it, what we've done is we've um, gone on to the uh, browse gallery, we've added a bear, we've added a black bear, um, and in the edit code section here, we've got the bear to nod its head. So basically bear gets neck, turns forward, bear gets neck, turns backwards. And we're doing it by a quarter turn, so when we press run, you can see his head go up and down. Okay. What we're going to do in this section is we're going to get the bear to open his mouth. So when we go back to scene setup, I'm going to go a bit closer again so I can try and see uh, the bear a little bit more uh, clearly. Um, so when we look at it, we can see what we're doing. I'm going to add a camera marker there again. I'm going to call this close up of bear, which allows us to go back here easily if we want to later. Now in the edit code section already, we've set this bit here. What we're now going to do is we're going to go into the bear cup and on the bear cup here we're looking for get mouth so on the get mouth section what we want to happen here is we want to get him to turn his mouth if we get him to turn it forwards um, by about a quarter turn and press run so he comes up does his three nods and then you see he starts to open his mouth. Now you can see that's clearly too far. It, it, his chin's gone basically right the way back into his head. So we're going to want to change that quarter turn to 0 0.125. Or we could go to a custom decimal number and make it different. But this should be fine. And once he's um, opened his mouth, we're going to want him to close his mouth. So we're going to go back to get mouth and turn. And after the forwards, we're going to want to backwards by the same amount. Again, if we just watch this through, he's going to do his nodding first. So he does his three nods. Then we should see him open his mouth, and then we should see him close his mouth. And what we do with that now is up to us, but what could be quite a nice function is that we have him opening and closing his mouth while he's saying something. So what I'm going to say here is, like with the last set, I'm going to put a loop in so that these keep on happening. And then I'm going to put all of that loop together in a do together section. So while it's doing this, then we can start to add an extra piece. And what I want it to do here is I want this bear cup to actually say something. So if we go down, there we go. And he's going to say, Hello, my name is Mr. Bear. Okay, so that's going to run through three times. While that's happening, the bears can be saying this. Now, if we watch this, I think we'll see there's a slight problem. So bear does his three nods, then his mouth starts to open and close. But the problem is the speech doesn't stay there very long. So what we want to do is we want to delay this. We want to use the add detail here to put this on for a set amount of time. So I'm going to use duration. And because the other one's going to be on for around three seconds, I'm going to use a custom number. And I'm going to set that to about three seconds. I could also use the add detail here to make this happen faster or for a shorter time. But I'll try it like that. So again, three nods. And then his mouth opens and closes. But while it closes, he's still got his speech on there. Okay. 